Well, this is a video I did not expect to see coming. Holy cow, folks. Check this out. So this is something that we haven't found out, that you guys probably haven't found out until now, that I had Chase Elliott shoes made in a shoe location in Concord Mills, which is the mall in our area, and we had these made. These are the Chase Elliott 1980 style feel eyes, and holy cow, did this guy do a great job. I don't remember his name, if I did, I'd mention it in the video and give him credit for it. But I'm sure he knows. Holy cow, folks. And as you can tell, these are the Chase Elliott shoes that are partially inspired by Chase Elliott's paint schemes, of course. Mainly the Napa one. And, of course, it would be the one with the blue number 9 because it's got the blue number 9 on the shoe itself. So there it is, folks. And for these videos, I'm going to show you them on the table here so there it is i'm just gonna pan the camera around them i'm not gonna touch them or anything like that i'm just gonna pan my camera around so you can see number nine yeah that's right folks i'm a chase Elliott fan why wouldn't you have a number nine <laughs> shoes i guess i'll touch it at the bottom so i'm not gonna touch the paint or anything like that i'm just gonna use the bottom and i believe it was only on one of the sides yep and the side that was painted on was the side that you could see and this is what the other side looks like Got the blue and the strip, and of course, what everyone wants to see. The number nine, baby. Just like Chase Elliott's got it. Look at that. How cool is this? So, if Chase Elliott, if you're watching this video, I'm a massive fan of yours because, as you can tell, you couldn't tell already that I'm, all, I'm a fan of yours. There it is. There, that is so cool, man. And I'm telling you, I will be headed over to the Charlotte Motor Speedway. Well, not watching the race, but at least I'll be walking around uh, the stands and stuff. Maybe the gift shop and things like that. And man, if you're there, you're going to see these and you're going to be like, holy cow, it's authentic. It's awesome. And the first time I've ever seen was at the Lionel Racing Retail Store when my dad showed it off there. And, man, it was awesome, man. It's so cool. So awesome looking, man. And you can see all the details of it, man. The blue for the shoe's hood, I guess you could say, quote-unquote. And then the stripe on the side is yellow, obviously. And that yellow stripe is trying to be this paint scheme. But I don't have a 124, so I'm just showing you the little one. You can see that right there. Uh, the yellow stripe representing that. And, of course, the number nine, baby. And it kind of looks cool. Very, very nice looking, man. These look so awesome. Just like the car itself, man. I mean, it doesn't get any better than this. Number nine. And this here is my first ever Chase Alley diecast that I ever got. And it was at the Bristol Motor Speedway. And I still have it to this day. And I'll forever keep it. Because this is the first Chase Alley diecast I've ever gotten. You know, the black that windows closed the uh, window and things like that. So there it is, folks. I really, really, really like this, man. This is so cool. And this would kind of be a cool display if I kept the shoes with the car and things like that. So, yeah, Chase, if you're watching this video, and his fans, too. I don't want to leave the fans out. What do you guys think of this? This is beautiful, man. I really like these things, and I guarantee you they'll be worth, like, maybe... 200 300 bucks once they're signed if hopefully I get them signed. I would hope so That would be really cool of him like if he saw me walking around with these He'd be like wow That's so cool. So there it is man Chase Elliott fan with the Chase Elliott shoes and the die cast and this is so awesome man You can see the first ever die cast and comparing the car to the shoes. I say it's a perfect match it's got all the white and the numbers themselves. So there it is, folks. I bet you didn't see this type of video coming. Man. That's just so cool. Really glad to have all this, man. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed watching the video. If you're a Chase Light fan, I hope you I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I hope you actually like it because this is so something really cool here, man. You don't see this kind of stuff every day. And there it is. Every angle of the car and all that. So there it is. Chase Elliott fan with the Chase Elliott shoes, baby. That's so cool. 
So, thank you guys for watching. If Chase and I are watching this video, I hope to see you at the racetrack. And you can take a look at these things. I hopefully get a nice autograph on them. And if I'm lucky enough, if I'm smart enough, I'll bring one of these along. So, there it is, folks. Chase Elliott fan with the die cast and now painted shoes to go along with it. How awesome is that? So, if you're a Chase Elliott fan, I hope you guys like this video. This is for you guys, all the Chase Elliott fans out there. And there it is. That's really, really cool. So, that's really cool. I want to thank the people that painted it over there. It was a lot of fun uh, to get these made and to have them and make this video. So, that's going to be it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But man, these are Chase Elliott shoes, man. Can't go wrong with them. Number nine, number nine, number nine, baby. The best in the business, Chase Elliott. There it is. Yes. So awesome. Hope, hope you guys like the, I hope you guys like the feel eyes. That's it. That's my video on them. And I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'm going to take a quick little uh, thumbnail picture before I close out the video. All right. There it is, folks. See you guys next time. Chase Elliott, number nine.